Hello everyone and welcome back to My Crafting World. This is Anna. Well, I wanted to share with you my birdhouse and it is such a gorgeous, gorgeous day today. I thought I would come outside and do it. So, oh my goodness guys, I love how this turned out. And if my if my if I shake my phone, I am so sorry. I am trying to oop, I am trying to hold it steady. Um, it is kind of hard to get the whole thing in the in the frame, but this is the overall view. Oh my gosh, guys! So let me show you what I've done. Let's start. Um, let's start at the bottom. So this, I am so sorry about that, guys. Hang on. Okay, there we go. This is a an eight by eight black chipboard um, piece and I've just lined it with this pretty paper. So anyway, I just lined it with this pretty paper and I wanted to put um, like a little table or a, a you know a, a little bench or something but yeah, I just don't want to go out to the store. I just don't want to go anywhere. Um, we I think we're about to get um, orders to stay home. I'm not sure, but I really think so. Anyway, so I put my birdhouse up on this. It, it's the core of the um, the faux leather, you know, the little, the, the core center that it, they come on. That's all that is. And I've just lined it with flowers at the bottom. And of course, guys, um, AS Sea Crafts has most of the supplies that you would need to make this. So I cut out, and I'm sorry for the street noise, but I cut out a fence with a die that I had and I cut it out of some uh, brown foam, five millimeter foam. And I just glued it at the bottom all the way around. And I put some eggs here and there and these little bunnies um, that I had in my stash. I did go ahead and put little, uh, you know, the little shiny pearl, or not pearls, but the little shiny sequins that I have. And then I put some green vine all the way around the fence on the inside. And I did glue flowers here and there just to dress it up a little bit. And there are my little bunnies, they're so adorable and let me see if i can pull it a little bit closer try not to move the camera and then i put some eggs on this side as well and this little egg was given to me in a swap last year and i thought you know colors are great i think they go very well with um, the color scheme that i have going on and then I had some little butterflies that were plain white butterflies and I added some stickles to them. This one, as well as the one in the back. And then again, I added the little um, sequins. They're not sequins, they're the little gems, flat back gems. And I had some of this vine go, I put it all the way around the pole, going down the pole. This is from a different paper pad, but as you can tell, I went ahead and and ink spots so that it would match a little bit better with the colors that I have going. And yeah, so the core is just glued down. You probably can't even can't even tell. I had painted that that plastic circle that is on either side. I had painted it um, pink, but you can't. You know, honestly, you can't even. You can't even see it. I don't think I need it. There we go. There's just a little bit showing. Right, where's my finger? Right there. So I had painted it pink just so it would uh, match a little bit better. But you, I mean, you just can't even see it. Let me see if I can show you the top. There it is. You can see the top where it is pink i had painted that one as well and if i you know if i wanted to i could actually you know scrape that this pink you know i could scrape it off and then uh just use my tabletop for my house 
So let's go over the house now. So this is the front side and I just love how it turned out. And of course, you know, this is my main piece. I just love that. And all I did was I put another little bunny here and then a little egg and I added stickles. I cut that egg, it's a star foam egg. So I, I cut it in half and added more stickles to it because the glitter on there was, you know, was not very good. And then all the flowers, these are Prima flowers and uh, I don't remember what these are. But anyway, you can get, um, ASC has so many flowers that you, you can choose from and I especially, oh, love the tiny ones like this one right here i love those and because they make great fillers and then i had also you know like the green vine that's here at the bottom um i also have gold so i just cut out the little leaves and put them on there and then this is another little uh you know spray that i got from joanne and then there's my little bird i just glued him up there and from a distance you know, it doesn't look like, well, at least to me, it doesn't look like a round die cut, the hole, the little entry. It looks like a hole, you know, like the actual hole in there. But anyway, so that is the front. I love, love, love the front. And then I can turn it and this is the side. I put a little uh, window on either side and it's hard to tell, but I put acetate on there. So you can see the reflection. I put acetate like a real window. And then on the top, I put um, this beautiful gardenia right here. And you can get that one ASC craft supplies and then other flowers. And those are the little fillers that I got from ASC. Butterfly that I had in my stash. And this one is a 49 in market. And uh, this one is part of that, this collection right here. So yeah, and I just uh, put stickles around, you know, some of the flowers, like the gardenia, the, uh, you know, some of the, the butterfly, some of the, you know, I just use stickles throughout. And then I use the purple stickles right here for the little hearts, for inside the hearts. And then I put some trim on the top. So yeah, guys, oh my gosh, I love it. And the back, I didn't do anything to, just because I feel like that's gonna be more, you know, towards a wall or something, so it's not gonna show very much. And this is the other side. And again, um, let me see if I can show you, see the shine from the um, acetate. I thought that was a cute little touch. And again, I didn't, that's all I did to the sides. And this is the other side. This is the one that actually opens. Okay, and on that side, I just put a bow with a little pearl center and some little, um, you know, the little gems there. And that is the other side. Guys, I am so in love with my birdhouse. Of course, you don't have to put it on a, you know on, on a little pole like this i just thought it was really cute it is too big for my crafting area so i am hoping that i can make space for it somewhere if not i can always take it off of this and just put the birdhouse up on a shelf but yeah guys oh my gosh i hope everyone is staying safe and um you know doing what you love best whether that be crafting cooking watching television, YouTube, Netflix, whatever it is, guys, just stay safe. Um, as you know, and as I said before, that's why I haven't actually finished this bottom. I wanted to go and find, you know, some, maybe some miniatures to go there, but, um, that'll have to wait. It's not as important as, you know, our safety is. All right, guys. Oh, it's such a gorgeous day. All right, guys, it's so hard to believe that, you know, we're infected the way we are. You know, there's so many germs and whatnot going around. But yeah, this brings joy to me. So guys, I hope that you've enjoyed this this quick video and of my final reveal. 
All right, guys, y'all have a great day. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Love you all.